Yo, so I was able to sell Manny Machado after winning 12 games. We sold him for a million and 900,000 stubs after tax. That puts us at over 1 million stubs. On this video, we're going to see if we can hit 300 or more likes, 100 or more new subscribers. I'm going to be 21s right around the corners, continuing those daily uploads every single day. Comment down below how many diamonds you think we're going to pull with this 1 million stub pack opening twitter instagram twitch twin gaming tv on their daily streams from will be 21 you don't want to miss it i'm gonna go ahead spend a million stubs on headliners packs i'm not gonna do any others just because uh i don't really want to do standard i think that would take too long and then i don't want guaranteed diamonds right i want to have the chance to get a diamond we got more guaranteed diamonds coming up in a couple days so today i'm focusing on headliners i actually didn't realize how many packs this was going to be so i'm thinking that this is going to be divided into two parts i would assume part number two is going to go up tomorrow but no matter what in the next few days all right we're just going to go set one through two i'm probably going to quick flip everything if i can just because watching those diamonds walk out i know it'd be nice to see it, it would be cool to try to guess who it is and stuff like that hey there's one diamond we got cody bellinger not worth nearly as many stubs as he was earlier in the year one thing i am gonna do is two diamonds in a row okay wow why can't this happen to me normally why i mean did i i wonder if they increase the pack outs at the end of the year i swear to god it always seems like they do uh but it's probably placebo if you guys saw my last pack opening i did a, a little bit ago a few weeks ago it was just terrible so we're just gonna keep doing that uh if you guys see me kind of stop after we pull the diamond it's because i am just keeping track of how many diamonds we've pulled and so far we're at two it was pretty quickly two in a row uh cody bellinger and i think that was kirby yates but i i low-key wasn't paying enough attention i just saw that it wasn't you know jacob de or mike trout or somebody like that one of the ones that are more expensive cody b used to be not anymore and i'm just ready for mlb 21 i don't really know what i'm going to talk about during this or part two of the pack opening if i do decide to, to divide it into two parts it really just depends on how long it takes me once we get through so there's 50 sets for headliners and i figure hey we can just get to 25 and then see where we're at right just take 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 a look see how long we're into the pack opening yo a diamond right here denelson okay number three the thing is I, I i almost guarantee that all the cards and diamonds and whatever we pull in these headliners packs will not add up to a million stubs so that's okay i don't have a use for stubs right i'm gonna be 21s around the corner it's not like there is year to year saves right they don't have those for 21 they've said so I, and I don't even I don't even think I can really I mean I guess I could buy equipment for a road to the show player but it's like I can't bring a road to the show player with equipment or something over to hey we got a headliner I'm pretty sure he's a headliner Johnny Bench 5,000 stubs I have a feeling majority if not all the diamonds we pull in this video will be less than 20,000 stubs we could get lucky get somebody like Mike Trout or something as we get another one that's number five already I hope you guys don't mind this too by the way uh us not having them walk out but like literally the walkouts are like 30 seconds to a minute of extra time per walkout and for me it's just like dog i don't i don't think anyone at this point in the year wants to sit through that it's one thing when it's like early on in the year you're like getting hype like it might be worth something but no nah, not uh <laughs> and now it's uh, not at this point in the year that's number six by the way we just got another diamond if you guys missed it that's number six also let me make sure i'm recording yes we are because I, I there's a pause recording feature and i've been using that a little bit recently so wanted to make sure i didn't accidentally have it still on i was using that while i bought the packs another one mookie dog how is he 93 overall worth worth less than 10,000 stubs that's crazy that's wild to me man oh my goodness also uh a lot of times for my videos especially ones where there is no gameplay i like to always be talking because for me i'm sitting here like if i'm just in i, I guess it is a little bit different because you guys can see the webcam and stuff and you can see what i'm doing but it's like i feel like if i'm just sitting here silent that's <laughs> i, I want to say that's not entertaining 
But at the same time, I feel like me just spouting off random stuff, talking about random stuff is maybe not super entertaining either. So I feel like it'd be different if I had jokes or a story or something like that, but it is what it is. But we've done these in the past and uh, I, I know that, you know, especially with longer videos, the talking can get to be a little bit much. Two in a row again. That's the second time. Hey, that's the second time. We're, we're trying to set a record for diamonds in a row, baby. Come on, let's get three. Nah, we got two in a row, though, again. Vita Blue. I hope a good Vita Blue card comes out. Like, I, I actually, I was going to say early on in the year, but, man, that silver killed me in BR all year. I kind of I kind of want them to, to wait <laughs> to release that version of him. Give us the diamond one. I don't care. People don't draft that in BR. Just, man, don't, don't let that silver be in BR from day one. He killed me. He killed me. Also, there's honestly a chance that I miss a diamond when I'm going through like this, right? Like I missed one right there or something. And if that happens and you guys notice it, please let me know in the comments because I don't want to miss a diamond. You know, I definitely don't. Oh, man. Yeah, this is going to take a lot longer than I thought. And, and like, I kind of want to sell them, but there's no point. There's no, e there's no easy way to sell another one there's no ease that's number 10 we're already in double digits that's kind of crazy i feel like this is i i don't know is, is this better two in a row again for the second time i don't know if this is better than i i mean this is definitely better than normal for me for headliners but i haven't been paying attention to how many packs we've opened i should have uh i guess you guys will have been able to see the quantity owned so we can we can actually tally it that's that's not bad yo another one number 12 so what's the, what's the chance for a diamond in these? What are the odds? It's one in 10 chance. And I, yeah, I don't know how many we bought. Cause I, I bought a little, I had some extra laying around. Uh, and then I bought a little bit more than a million stubs worth. So what I'm going to have to do, and if anyone wants to do it for me, uh, if anyone wants to be a real MVP, you know, uh, maybe go back and start tracking this and it wouldn't be that hard to just see what the quantity owned of the packs were and just see how many diamonds we got in the video tally that up I'll, I'll, I should be able to have the count because I'm, I'm counting it up right now I got 12 uh, but where I need y'all to come in which I can do this myself in a few days too is check the quantity owned and see how many packs we opened. So, so how many diamonds we got versus how many packs we opened. Was it worse than 1 in 10? Was it better? Was it pretty much 1 in 10? My guess is with how many we're opening. Uh, especially after part 2. I don't know about part 1 because, you know, it's only it's only 25 sets. Uh, but especially after we do both parts of this. Which I think I will do it in more than one video. I feel like that's just a little bit too long. Hey, another diamond. Uh, I, I feel like it's going to come out to about 1 in 10. And if I had a guess, probably a little bit worse based on my luck all year. But you never know. I don't think that's two in a row again for the third time or fourth time. I don't even know at this point, but uh, it was pretty close to one another. I got to pay attention, though, because I, I want three in a row. Also, I want a, dumb, I want a double diamond pack. Uh, I got a double diamond pack first week of... God, I think I'm going to be 19. And then it has not happened to me since then. I've seen it happen to people on Twitter. That's two diamonds in a row again. Kind of crazy. Let's see if we could get three. I don't know if there's a world record for, for most packs with a diamond in a row. That is, like, obviously not guaranteed diamonds. You know, like headliners or Fallen as a Habit, Team Affinity, Standard. I don't know any other packs. But I would assume it's probably three. Three or four. I would say four. You know, because uh, two seems pretty easy based on how this is going today, which makes me think that somebody would get lucky and get three, which makes me think that somebody like one person would get extremely lucky and get four. Again, I have no idea. Maybe y'all watching right now. If you've had packs with diamonds in a row, let me know. Hey, another one. We, we were on a diamond drop for a little bit. I was starting to think that, that I lost my luck a little bit. Man, I, I, I wish I would have been counting uh, in my head, which I probably would have gotten all, all mixed up with how many diamonds we pulled, like trying to keep that straight. But I wish I would have been counting in my head how many packs we've been opening because I'm, I'm super curious. I want to know, are we beating the odds? Are we right around the odds? Because I've gotten 17 and I feel like I haven't opened 
170 packs but at the same time we're going through them so fast i really don't know man this is a lot of packs i'm, I'm glad that i didn't do any of the ducks in the pond because I, I i i think i have a couple of those and the home run derbies maybe i have home run derby i actually don't know about that um but like if i really wanted to i can always go through sell my diamonds and uh and buy some of those because i'm doing a guaranteed diamonds pack opening where uh, i think every pack in the video i do would be hey another diamond man I i'm I i'm actually mind blown that i haven't gotten like one of the good ones like degrom or trout i'm kind of sad about it i'm not mind blown but i'm sad um but so tomorrow i think we're gonna have part two which what tomorrow's monday for y'all yeah i think i'm gonna have part two of this hey matt chapman another diamond and then god maybe just the next day maybe keep the packs going have my guaranteed diamonds it's gonna be like over 70 diamonds and if i decide to buy some ducks on the pond and homer and derby whatever that bundle is in the shop it's gonna be way more but right now i think for me it's sitting at 66 diamonds in one pack opening it is what it's at right now um so that's probably coming i would say tuesday which we might add on to that if, if i'm really feeling up to going through and selling all the diamonds we get freddie freeman right there number 20 of the video um so i don't know we'll just have to wait and see but i i, I might decide to get some of those you guys will see but we're gonna have a lot of just a ton of packs being opened um between now and launch another diamond right there number 21 also one thing that i'm probably gonna do is on thursday this is my plan right now is in the morning around noon central which is when i've been trying to upload but it's been varying a little bit recently uh what i'm gonna try to do is have a pack opening just whatever packs are left right i'm gonna ha i have some ball and some standard whatever's left just saying goodbye to mlb 20 pretty much is what i want that video to be and uh so just whatever's left if i have any random packs ball doesn't have it whatever um just open those and just say goodbye yo a double diamond oh my god um i just got two diamonds in one pack uh this literally this might be its own video like i, I don't i don't know it, like and not its own video but i might put this in somewhere uh paul molitor and fernando tatis jr Th this might be going somewhere uh like maybe that's going to be thursday's title that that clip is probably going to be in something else because right now this is the million stub but i i want to showcase that in the video right i got two diamonds in one pack there it is my first double diamond since i'm gonna be 19 the first week of the game that's awesome i honestly did not think that was going to happen to me and i'm gonna be 20 i really didn't i'll take that for sure and i'm hoping that that's a sign of things to come for 21 i'm hoping launch night or the or, or opening weekend i can get a double diamond let's go that's that actually like um, even though they were two low level diamonds like that does not happen often it really doesn't so that's just that that made me happy uh it really did like like yeah it's been cool to see diamonds pop up oh two in a row whatever um but i, I you know none of these were exciting me really the only thing i was going to get excited about uh it was going to be trout or i guess Degrom is is one worth a lot rob dibble is actually not bad um that's diamond number 24 but it's like none of the diamonds have really been exciting me too much you know it's like it's like diamonds don't matter but getting a double diamond two diamonds in one pack actually just like it got me excited that's cool that's that's really cool to see that's sick we're coming to an end sort of <gasps> yeah. okay uh what i got four diamonds in two packs oh my god i like I, I don't even know what to say okay well who is it rob dibble again that's big man that's di that's diamonds number 25 and 26 so it happened twice i swear to god they have had to do something with the pack odds for for since we're so close to 21 i swear to god they had to because i've never pulled this many diamonds in headliners and, and part of it is i'm sure how many i'm opening but i'm pretty sure i'm i'm way against the odds i feel like i have to be i could be wrong though like i i could be below the odds and i'm just opening so many but i feel like i'm getting them at a better rate than one to ten you know we've got in 26 so far have i opened more than 260 i don't know 
I, ha I, I, I literally would have no way of knowing. Um, let's just say we average 10. I don't think so. I really think we are, are beating the odds right now, which with that being said, I could all of a sudden go and get none for the rest of the video. Uh, that would be like a typical pack opening for me. But... Oh, man. I see. And like right now, I don't want to just keep talking and talking and talking because we talked a ton. But I also I don't want to sit here. I guess you know what I, I was. Ah, man, I don't know. I don't know. Um, I don't have much to say. Nothing's on my mind right now. I'm actually a little bit tired. I waited way too long in the day to record this video. I've been playing through. Hey, yo, this is a good question. If you guys are watching this video right now, uh, maybe in the comment section below, let me know if you've been doing anything to try to pass the time. For me, I've been playing Pokemon Emerald on my old Game Boy Advance SP. Uh, I've been playing through Pokemon Emerald, and I am on to the final four. Or final four. I'm on to the Elite Four right now. And um, I'm trying to get through that a little bit with my Swampert. I don't use any other Pokemon in my, on my team. Uh, I'm, I'm a one Pokemon team, and that's Swampert. I think he's level 70 right now. And uh, it's been a little bit tough because for some reason, all the Elite Four trainers have Pokemon that are water types or ice types where it makes my Swampert's main attacks, three of his four, not very effective versus them. And so it's just been a little bit of a struggle for that. I, I really should have got, gone through the game differently, but you know, I'm just trying to have fun, trying to pass the time. And it's actually going by, like it's making it go by fast. I will say like, I'll, I'll be sitting there just going through, uh, you know, progressing through the story, beating gyms, whatever you do on Pokemon. And I'll look up and like a few hours has passed. And I'm like, wait, what? Like, it's actually been a really good way for me to pass the time. It's been nice. I I've been enjoying it for sure. Also, I got to pay attention. I'm stopping at 25. So, uh, 25, 26, 27, 28, 29. So, I'm going to go through set 25. I'm going to do all the set 25. And that's where we're going to end. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I think that's what I'm going to do. Ooh, Lance Lynn. Okay. Okay, that's diamond number 5, 10, 15, 20, 25. That's diamond number 29. So we are one away from 30. That's two in a row. So we just got 30. We just got diamond number 30. Oh, man. Not three in a row. Sad. Disrespectful. That's okay. All right. Last 10 of the video, y'all. The last 10 of the video. Here we go. And maybe, maybe while the video, while I, after I uh, edit the video, I got to export it and then upload it. Maybe while it's doing that, I can just go through and check quantity owned and hopefully in the description or in a comment or neither. Uh, and I'll forget to do it. I'm lazy, but I want to check the quantity owned and just see how many packs we open today. We're sitting at 30 diamonds even. Looks like that might be what we end the video at too, unless we get lucky in these last two, but... All right, one pack to go for this video. We've gotten 30 diamonds. Can it be more in the first half? Part one ends on 30 diamonds. I should be seeing you guys for part two tomorrow. Like, comment, subscribe, social medias. That's 30 diamonds. If you want to add up the quantity, own, feel free. Otherwise, I'll do my best to. And I will see you guys next time tomorrow. Probably noon central if I had to guess. But like, comment, subscribe, social medias, all that good stuff. Hope you have a fantastic rest of your day. Thank you as always for watching. I'll see you tomorrow.